what up everybody welcome back to the channel y'all know what we're doing today z-axis edge finding xyz axis we're gonna set this up and i'm gonna show you how to do it on the 6090 right here cnc let's go all right so first thing you're gonna want to do when you're setting up your Z finder is you're gonna go in, you're gonna have to go in your control box here. I have mine sideways, you know, just excuse me, it's, it's kind of a mess, but basically in the back, if there isn't, if there is not a spot to put your edge finder, which I didn't, I had to put one in. Uh, usually they have it already set up for you, but you know, you know, uh, it's hit or miss with China. Either way, shout out to the Chinese. Y'all made a nice device. Um, but if you need to go into the board and wire it yourself like I had to do, it, it goes right here. Just all you have to do is trace back the emergency stop right here. Trace back the emergency stop all the way back to where it goes to. That is the board that you need to plug your two wires into that go to the edge finder, which are this and this, which are these two. So basically, you find your you open this up, find your emergency stop, trace it back. You go to the ground where the emergency stop is, and then go to the, uh, a free a free pro, and you know put your two cords, one in ground, one in a new slot pro, and then you're gonna have to check it on the computer. I'll show you how to do that right now. All right, so now we're at we're at Mach three right now. So what we're gonna do is. Oh, sh we're gonna go right here into diagnostics. Hopefully you can see it. Alt seven, right up here. We were over here, program one. We're gonna go all the way to diagnostic seven. So now you have to check, you have to make sure you're digitized right here. I don't really have a zoom on here, but there's a digitized. I'm also gonna show you on screen, right where my mouse is. Watch it light up. When we you know you did it right. You'll know you did your wiring right if when you touch the two pieces you get the digitizer to line up to light up so watch this oh oh shoot hold on i have to turn on the machine one second we have to register it again my bad i totally forgot i turned it off um so we reset it and we're good back to diagnostics for the check here we go there it is, y'all. You see how that, see that light right there? See that green light? That's the digitizer. If you tap your two pieces together and the digitized light comes on, you did, congratulations, you did it correctly. Now, smash the likes and we're gonna get back to this. So now after you check that, make sure everything is good. What you wanna do is you're gonna click, oh, no, no, what you're gonna do is go here. You're gonna go to config some is some some mach 3 it's an operator but mine is in config just look for edit button script this is most important here edit button script right now it's going to highlight a bunch of buttons we're going to click here auto tool zero all right and here's the code that came with this whole package so i'll leave this in the description so you can go buy it as well and the code will be supplied to you it's a great code. I tried, you know, doing this by myself on YouTube randomly. It didn't work out. Anyways, you take the code. So here's the code. I copied all the code. I deleted everything in here and I pasted that in. And then we saved the change. I already saved it, so we're gonna say no. But you would say yes. And now we're gonna go check. We're gonna go check how to do this on the machine right now. Oh shit. Right now. We're gonna restart this because I was a bad, I did a bad, you know, dramatization there. So we're gonna re recenter the, the corner edge hole right here to find the edge. So auto zero one center hole finder. Let's go.
twice to get a, you know, better reading, of course. And there it is, y'all. We found the center hole. Smash the likes. So that basically kind of concludes today's the triple axis the edge finder for your cnc machine if y'all got any questions you know just just buy the fucking bracket and ask the dude like all i did was upload the code and i was ready to go i was pounding my head on youtube on the computer trying to do this you know randomly i was using tape before i was trying to tape my edge oh my god no link below buy it right now shouts out to uh shouts out to dude who made that he did a great job um Smash the like and subscribe. We're gonna start cutting a lot more, all right? So, see y'all later. Stay tuned, follow us on Instagram at Dynamic Automation. Don't forget, hit that bell. See y'all later, peace.